Hi, I'm Sage Lewis. I'm the president of SageRock.com, and today I wanted to talk to you about link popularity. When you're dealing in search engine optimization, there are two main umbrellas that you're working under. One is what we call on-the-page criteria, which is your page content and uh, the, the code on your page and that type of thing. But then the other side is off-the-page content, and that's uh, what I want to talk today about. And this is called link popularity. And so I wanted to show you very quickly how you determine what your link popularity is. So right now we're looking at a site called the Senior Care Investor Newsletter. And as you can see here, it says the inside story on mergers and acquisitions in the nursing homes and assisted and independent senior living. So this is their home page. And uh, we're going to look at three different sites that uh, to help determine how many sites are linking to SeniorCareInvestor.com. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go over to Google and we're going to simply type in their URL, the full URL, but right before it I'm going to put in a definition that says link colon and then HTTP colon slash slash www.SeniorCareInvestor.com and then I simply hit Google search and now this shows the links that are pointing to SeniorCareInvestor.com and uh, just briefly you can see here the results of 1 of 11 of about 27 so there's that one now we're going to do the same search over at Yahoo okay and so this is Yahoo's home page and I'm just going to paste that in here and then I'm going to hit enter and now we can see one of 24 of about 202. So as you can see, there's a big discrepancy between the number of links Google has. Of they, they're recording that there are about 27 links pointing into SeniorCareInvestor.com. And Yahoo is recording that there are 202 links pointing into SeniorCareInvestor.com. So you might think, well, maybe Google doesn't realize all of the links that are there. The fact is Google knows exactly how many links are there, but they are trying to hold that information um, privately. They don't want you to know all the links that they know about. So when you're doing a link popularity check, it's oftentimes helpful to go to Yahoo and do this, this research. But I wanted to show you the discrepancy between Google and Yahoo and why maybe a search engine optimizer might show you a link popularity uh, report from Yahoo as opposed to, to Google. Yahoo is just a little more accurate. And then finally I wanted to show you one more site called Yahoo Search Site Explorer and it's in beta and it's an interesting site because it gives you a backdoor look of the order of importance of the links that uh, Yahoo has. And so what this does is shows you two things and uh, it shows you First of all, we'll hit enter here, and it's going. The first thing it's going to show you is the number of pages that Yahoo has recorded for SeniorCareInvestor.com, uh, and what is different in this case, uh, as opposed to just going to regular Yahoo, is that it's in order of importance. So, um, SeniorCareInvestor.com is actually a brand new site. Uh, they've opened up a, a web blog there about the merger and acquisition uh, information in the healthcare industry. And so if you're you know, looking for stocks, I recommend checking it out. But what I wanted to show you here is the in-link section here. So when I, when I entered in the URL into the Yahoo Site Explorer, this was the page that came up. Now, here I'm going to click on in-links, which shows 242. And what's interesting here is these are in order of importance as according to Yahoo. So this gives you a lot of inside information where Google didn't give you any inside information at all. Yahoo's telling you a great deal. So their link from levinassociates.com is very important. The number two, uh, the company's covered by our Levin Associates research. And, and it goes on from there. And so there's multiple Levin Associates links, and those are highly regarded as far as Yahoo is concerned. But then we have healthcareamanda.com and so on. So if you want to find out how many links are pointing to you and how important each link is, this is how you do it. All right, have a good day.